Here are five easy tips to make your beef jerky better. Let's make beef jerky. The first is how you cut your meat. This is incredibly important because it's going to depend if you want some chewy beef jerky or some harder beef jerky. I like to cut mine against the grain because this makes the jerky less chewy and more soft. I don't want that hard stuff here. Now don't take this the wrong way, but your beef jerky depends on the thickness, alright? I like to cut mine in one fourth of an inch to get the perfect crisp beef jerky. The next super important tip is get a no leak container. I cannot tell you how many times I put something in the fridge and woke up to my wife screaming at me for the mess that I just made. And guess what? I gotta get downstairs with my boxers and clean it up. Don't let that happen to you. The next step and probably the most crucial part in your beef jerky process is the marinade. This is incredibly important to infuse a flavor and I like to marinate mine for up to 24 hours. I've gone up to two days but it's going to take up a lot of space in your fridge and how much space can you not live with? what a packed Grilla Girl chimp looks like. It is packed with beef jerky. We're gonna put it to 180 for about four and a half hours and uh, see how this turns out. And the last tip I'm gonna leave you with is taste. Don't be afraid to open a smoker every once in a while and taste it. Take a piece, give it a try, and get it to your liking.